If you issue prayers, if you give help speeches, if you insult people, you should have done ready to get teeth breaking answer a reply from this AW Versatile TV. Just last week, you should a hate speech, you should threats and the threats are statements are very insulting to certain in this country. Here she is. His name is Anand Kishor. He is an Emily from UP. He said if you want to sacrifice in the answering Idul Adha, so he said, sacrifice not the cows, animals, buffaloes, camels, goats. If you really want to sacrifice, sacrifice your children. Do you think this statement should got quality to not to be answered? Do you think this statement is not insulting? is not a threat. It is not violation of our Indian constitution. Is it not? Hate speech. Yes, this is a hate speech. I am now thinking how to reply him. The way I am thinking how to answer him in which way. There are many ways, there are many layers to answer. There are many levels to reply him. Which way I should go? But I am giving this reply in different way. Man, why he issued this insulting statements against Muslim communities? Is it his love of animals or he is too much worried about the COVID-19 patients in India. Apparently, too many people it can be, but to me, his real intention is nothing about the curing, loving of COVID-19. Nothing about love of animals. If you love animals, you may but this is not an absolute thing in this world because killing of animals is not belongs to certain community. You know, your philosophy or your apparent love, affection for the animals is not justified. From the morning to the evening, from evening to the morning, 24 hours, you kill insects, plants, you eat bread, you kill wheat, rice you eat, you kill the rice plant. The killing is a must necessary thing to people. So your love affection to the animal is not total, is not just compulsory to, you know, his hate is so much against certain community that he started insulting before Idul Adha. Corona, COVID-19 is just a pretext to insult people, to prevent people to celebrate Idul Adha. He is such a cruel man he said, who wants to sacrifice, they should sacrifice their children. Do you have, Mr. Children? Can you sacrifice your children? Can I say so? I am not such uneducated or half-baked educated man. I am not insensitive to ask you to sacrifice your children. 
you will say, no, I do not sacrifice. It is your individual outlook. But as an Indian community, there are many communities in India where sacrifices had been going on, have been going on for long since civilization started here. But you don't, do you know, if I go further, then you will see that we sacrifice animals, but there are certain communities, maybe you belong to that communities, who sacrifices human being. So your love is for animals, but you do not love human beings. You know, there are many people who call themselves animal lovers. But you do know, animal is killing all over the world. And it is justified killing to feed you up. But yet, the raises questions. But they remain silent. When men are lynched in India, men are killed in India. Few months back, during this resigns, these resigns, Akhlaq was murdered, Pehlu Khan was murdered, these pet lovers, animal lovers, never raised questions because they are biased. They are just a soul where that is full of it and they are owner of it. That means they are the dirty soul, always putting forth only dark hate against certain communities of people. To insult them, they issued statements, they gave speeches, so that division should be there and hate is there. They never care about anything. Their intention is. Do you know, many people may say that it is a statement only and nothing else. Then you know, Another level I am going to answer you. If you, under any pretext, whether it is affection for animals, or affection for plants, affection for insects, love for whole universe, you prevent man to sacrifice animals, then here in this world, you know what people say? People say, come man, come and prevent us to give sacrifices, I will sacrifice you. This is the answer. People give to you. Come. You cannot. Another level is that there are 130 crores people in India. There are many kinds of people. Some are real dirty souls. They always put forth hate, dirt, biased attitudes, neglect, they always want to insult people. They are issuing insulting comments, statements in tea stalls, in markets, in roads, in the streets. Why, Indian media, you put this dart and discuss to insult, spread it first, and that spreading is nothing but indirectly. You want to listen. You want to listen to people this hit so that they can take it as an insult. You want to just put in those people in front of their faces to their ears so that the man he has targeted, he must listen through our television channels. There are many people issuing all the time hate speeches. There is no need to take the issue and discuss and insult the people. But Unfortunately, this issue has been discussing in many television channels. The issue threat that action will be taken. Do you know Indian Constitution? I know Indian Constitution. I have the right to observe my fight. Nothing and nobody can prevent it. India does not belong to any person. India actually belongs to who lives here through centuries. So, we shall give sacrifice. And you cannot prevent it.
You cannot issue insulting statements. And you cannot give threats for action. What action, man? What action? Action should be taken against you. Issuing statements, hateful statements, insulting people, insulting the faith of the people, creating hate among communities. You should be behind bar. FIR should be against you.